Hi viewers, this is uh, finally I bring the video for HVAC. What is the HVAC? HVAC basically, what is the purpose of using in building science is the HVAC. So I will equip to explain the HVAC function in building science. So if you would like to go for the abbreviation, heating, ventilations, and air conditioning system. So we are talking about the air conditioning system. In air conditioning system, HVAC basically we have a uh, you have to go with the window AC. You have to go with the split units and FCUs, and package units, and AHU, air handling units, and FHU, fresh air and handling units. So, what is the function for a window AC? Windows is so simple. You have to buy in market and just install to them in your home. So, this is the things now. Just have a little bit. You give you thumb rule for calculation for HVAC for window AC. For example, we are going to the 110 and is equal to, to the 12 square meter uh, 12 square meter room size and 3 meters and for uh, 3 by 4 room and height is 3 meter 3 meter is uh, enough uh, one ton if you have a more than 12 square meter room so you have to go to the 1.5 this is a just this is you have to put the window and this is the ventilation window ventilation switch there if you want to get a ventilation from outside 25 percent it will be take the fresh air from outside and 75 to be rooted or you have to close the ventilation system so it will be go 100 percent to this one this is a uh, up this is a, a, a window ac types then i will be explained to the this uh, this uh, split unit split unit is same like that same thumb rule we using to the 12 square meter room size room size we using a 12 square meter room size for Mm. for window uh, sorry uh, split units so split units basically one unit will be outside and one unit in the inside so there is the uh, there is some some piping of the gas you keep the outside the uh, machine and one inside so this is so simple and we will be go to the in, uh, professional projects in professional projects if you are uh, going with the package unit installation Package unit is the size approximate. You have to say this is a 25 ton square, 25 ton, or you have to calculate with the BTU how much the BTU because 12,000 BTU is equal to one ton or 400 CFM. This is so I have to calculate how much this one coming here. So just I am telling to you. And package unit, this unit basically this is same function like that. You have to bring the machine, keep outside, and you have to put the ducting and uh, you have to install the uh, air supply to everywhere so whenever you install to the mostly you have to put the ducts because this is a 25 ton so you cannot be supplying one room maybe this is several rooms and uh, silver halls will be covered so if you go into the duct duct you have to install this machina as per the machina we have a duct you have to make make by you or make or you ask to the manufacturer to make it or you have to buy the built -ins. Uh, as built, uh, you mean I means uh, you have to take the directly by, and then after that you have to install the ducting, and now you have to put the ducting, and ducting you have to need to the volume dampers, you have to install to the volume dampers, and where where you want to the air supply. For example, you will need a air supply in the room, so you have to balance the air in this room. So volume damper of the purpose is for uh, balancing the air and if you uh, after that uh, when you stall to the ducting so after the ducting you know for, uh, from edge uh, we have to need also the return duct as well because uh, the 75 percent air will be package unit will be take from the room as well and then 25 percent will be mixed so hu function is a uh, basically 75 percent air will be take from the room and 25 percent will be take from the uh, fresh air so it will mix it and go to the rooms and you have to balance with the volume dampers I mentioned earlier so before when you store the duct so you have to take the smoke test for duct so no leakage and then when you when you are going to install the duct so after that you have to take smoke test before the smoke test you have to check the this is uh, as per the smack now installation is correct or not correct you know uh, the threaded rod which you hang the ducts so this is as per the standard or not so everything will be checked so when you <coughs> duct installed and you have to balance the air 
when you uh, uh, when you are going to the when you are going to the balancing here so you start from the last not one you know you have to start from the last last diffuser will be open and first all previous one is be closed and you have to close this you have to close you know by the paper or or, or something like that you put the sheets or this one and all and last one is open for example we have to, we are coming to the 4000 cfm from the duct so last we need a 300 cfm so all will be closed and first we balance to the last one last one will be the 300 cfm you have to adjust and after that you have to go back to the next and next and next and next you have to balance like that you not started from the first you have to start from the last last will be 300 after 300 300 300 will be back this is a so simple of package unit if you are going to the fcus fan, fan coil units so i will i would like to tell you fan fan, uh, fan coil units we using to the high rise buildings this is compulsory you know. when you are making at the high rise building you must be use the fan coil units as i am telling to you so fan coil units so fan coil units is the function is that so fan coil unit will be connect with the ahu air handling unit is the outside of the building or in mechanical room and you have to connect this one uh, uh, connect how you connect with the water chill water supply and chill water return and ahu must be connect with a chiller plants you, this there is a domestic channel plant or you have to buy a 700 or you most of the most of the most of the shopping centers or offices buy a small chiller plant and keep it in the roof so this is 700 or 800 800 ton like that so they're putting a chill water pipe they are, they are putting a chill water pipes and we make the pump rooms and mechanical room and many things and because the function is here chill water uh, from chill water plant water is coming to the AHU and AHU a AHU and FCUs so all FCU will be connected with the chill waters mm, chill water plants and and all AHU will be connected with the chill water plants so because we need a uh, chillers when we are talking about to the high rise building high rise building we have to stop the FCU for example hotels you will take with the 20 story and 30 story and 25 stories so in every room we are providing to the uh, FCU fan coil units and inside of the fan, uh, room we have our thermostats and we, we install to the, uh, the FCU and the wall packages for our chill water. The water is coming and going back to the chillers and this is same like the AHU. If you are going to the stall to the AHU 25 ton or 30 ton, 35 ton like that so they need a chill water as well. So if you are going to the FCU. FCU we have one ton, 1.5 ton like that. The small, you know, FCU. So chill water is coming and back, and after that will be cooling the in the room. And if you are going to the AHU, this is a very huge, very big, you know. If you are going to the big, very big, very huge, and very big. So 35 ton or 25 ton or 25 ton like that. So this is same like that chill water coming from the chiller plant or chiller plant and going back to the chiller plant so this is the function for a, a chill water so uh, chill water system and we need uh, as we are going to the if we are going to the high rise building so we need a fresh air as well in corridor area and every room because because the because you know suffocations or the some some smells or like that so we have to provide to the FHU fresh air fresh air, fresh air, fresh air handling units so this is same like that of the air handling unit we keep in the same room and we have ducting to the uh, ducting to the corridor area or like that so this is basically function for uh, we provide a fresh fresh air so I already made the drawings you can see the drawings and you can enjoy it I hope it so this is uh, this is basically I am explaining you the base function of the AHU and main function of the FCU. So if you are going to the FCU, so we have to provide in FCU, we, this is with one room, 1.5 ton or 2 ton maximum up to be providing the room. So we provide the ducting. So in ducting, first we provide to the, in ducting, we provide to the per, perforated ducts or inline ducts from, from the AHU. For example, AHU is F, F, HU here. After that, we have to provide the uh, perforated duct. After that, the perforated duct basically is inside to the circles or inside the 
cloth like that you can see in google you can see in youtube so for example petak how the working so basically this is a sound uh, sound reducer or sonic equator you say like that so they will reduce the sound so you can it will be not come after that that will be equal to the room and then how many the for example you have a two or three uh, diffusers girls you get where the air is coming so you have to balance in vd volume number is there should be you know so we have to balance this one if you are coming to the ahu air handling unit so air handling unit is a different type for example you have a something is ground floor or first floor you want to provide a huge area by the ducting so you have a 35 ton or 50 ton or 100 ton ahu you have to install in ahu it's the same like that collect with the cello plant and water is coming and going back for chill again and we are I we have to explain you and each you, you this is same like ducting you have to install so first we start with the property duct and you distribute the uh, in or so ducting ducting for example uh, I will tell you one thing more there is also be using here uh, uh, you have to say like that uh, uh, fire rated wall may most of the fire rated wall so fire damper we using in fire pit wall. This is isolating for example we have a huge project we have and ducts passing there. So in some wall is a fire rated wall. So in fire rated wall we need to stall to the fire damper compulsory there. When you stall to the fire damper so in case of the fire it will be automatically closed. Or we have to stall the mostly in the motorized fire damper so it will be closed by the BMS system. So this is fire rated wall and fire fire uh, fire unitary we have to store you can see in the other video in youtube and google what is the fire, uh, uh, fire tempers ex explanation so this is hu explain it hu and we have to come to the toilet area toilet area we have for example toilet we have to ventilation we have to take the exhaust so we have one duct and we, we one duct in several toilets so we provide a one one exhaust fan for example each toilets need a 30 cfm or 15 cfm or 50 cfm exhaust from there so we have to calculate for example five toilet we have 30 30 uh, cfm each so 50 150 cfm we need to exhaust so we have to provide to the exhaust fan in the last so inline fan using their and uh, roof mounted fan and then it, uh, and others wall mounted for exhaust fan to provide to the 5 3 30 into 5 with 150 cfm we provide there and basically function for uh, exhaust of uh, small uh, smelly smelly air we have to take from the toilets so this is by the ceiling and covered by everything and this is grill we have to provide to the fire diffusers and grills and many things and this is same like the volume number we have to balancing this is and how we have to balance the air in AHU or the ducting area I will tell you in ducting or AHU we, we are balancing with the bellometers you can see the video in YouTube or Google there is many video for using for YouTube for example we need in, in a one grill need a 100, uh, 100 CFM so we have to provide their bellometer bellometer will be show the how much the air is coming there so we're using a bellometer for a balancing and we have to close all and volume damper a bellometer with the help of this so this is basically in ahu we have a i explained you the three and four functions one is the uh, one is the air conditioner then window ac and one is a split unit fcu ahu or fhu hope you understand the functions basically this is the basic basics of the ahu and ventilation system as well so FHU I uh, as well I have already explained this one so hope you understand it, the basic function of the EHU but later I will be explain the everything in firefighting and firefighting and this other uh, water supply and drainage hope you enjoy this video and you have to learn it if you have any comment please write down in comment box I will try to give the answer all the questions thank you bye bye and you have to don't forget to subscribe my channel. This is Afinali. Afinali. Thank you. Bye bye.